in Acts chapter 4, Peter and John are proclaiming the good news of the gospel. They had just witnessed Jesus dying on the cross and being resurrected from the dead three days later, appeared to them after He had come back to life and did ascended into heaven before their eyes and sent the Holy Spirit to fill them up. And they are proclaiming what they have seen. They are proclaiming the good news of Jesus Christ. They are healing people in Jesus' name. And what happens? The high priest and the Sanhedrin, those that persecuted or did not want to proclaim Jesus as their Lord and Savior, tried to stop them. In Acts chapter 4, they were, they were trying to stop after they had healed the lame man. Uh, they said to themselves, what are we going to do with these men? Everyone in, living in Jerusalem knows they have performed a notable sign and we cannot deny it. But to stop this thing from spreading any further among the people, we must warn them to speak no longer to anyone in this name. So they are saying they must warn Peter and John to keep their mouths shut about Jesus. To no longer talk about and proclaim the gospel. So they called them in and commanded them not to speak or teach at all in the name of Jesus. But Peter and John replied, which is right in God's eyes, to listen to you or to Him. You be the judges. As for us, we cannot help but speaking about what we have seen and heard. Imagine seeing Jesus down the cross. Imagine walking with Him, not sure, not really fully understanding, not really believing, and then believing and seeing Him die and then thinking it's all over. But yet, our Savior, Jesus Christ, comes back to life, reveals Himself to them, and then ascends into heaven and fills them full of the Holy Spirit. <clears throat> Imagine seeing that with your own eyes. They could not stop proclaiming what they have seen. They could not stop saying what Jesus had done in their lives. And that's my question to you today. Who are we going to listen to? Who is going to stop us? Are we going to listen to man? Or are we going to listen to God? Are we going to obey God and continue to proclaim the good news of the gospel? Are we going to stand up and fight for our right to proclaim Jesus is Lord. Jesus is our Savior.